Um. All right, so it's 12:32, and I am in the Target parking lot because I'm actually have have that stuff to do today. Bit of a stutter there. I just wanted to take a moment to show you that I am like, if, if I can, like, come on, I am covered in glitter. It's not showing up on that arm, but like you can see right there, there's like a speck. Come on, focus. Like, I can get it to... I am like glittery as hell, but it's not showing up there. It kind of is. And yeah, I nick myself with a razor shaving, but yeah. Like, there's you can kind of see a little speck there, but it's not really showing up on here. But I have not been near anything glittery as far as I know, so I have... No, thing won't stay up. No idea why I'm glittery, and right now, it probably looked like I was just showing you my forearms. That's F-O-R-E, arms. Yeah, um, so I tried to show you how glittery my arms are, but it didn't quite work out. So I have a dentist appointment at 1.15. Yes, I just got my hair done earlier. Got my Jedi, Ooh, my necklace is in my pocket. I hope it's in my pocket. Shit, um, hold on. Oh, my necklace, necklace, necklace. Give me a second. There we go. Okay. Gotta put my necklace back on. Yeah. Sorry, I'm gonna set this down a bit. And shit, I just dropped something down in the little crack of the seat thing. So, yeah. And I got my... There we go. Got that one on. And my Jedi earrings. I'm representing Star Wars today, apparently. And I have no idea what just fell in the crack of this... It's like the crack of doom down there. Can't drop something, it's gone forever, but you know, whatever. So I'm just going to amble around a bit until my dentist appointment. Um, okay, what did I drop? Oh, shit. Okay. okay. I'm just going to amble around until time to go. I'm getting two fillings done. Get my... Okay, now I'll finish up. There goes another lady in orange. Okay, um, yeah. I'm gonna go to Michael's and find some stuff for the dog memorial stone thingy I'm working on, and yeah. Okay, correction, apparently I'm going to Target because my grand just texted me in front of Target because we both got our hair done in the same place, and I guess she thinks we're hanging out until I have to go do my thing and she has to go do her thing, but uh. Excuse me. So it is now 1.30. I have a dentist appointment at 1.50. I'm sitting in the Target parking lot digging through my purse for my lipstick or chapstick, whichever, don't care. I go chapstick. And I just want to take a quick moment to complain about Target. Um, so I went in there to do the, like, you buy $20 worth of, um, like, like personal care products, like, um, shampoo, conditioner, lotion, things like that. And you get a $5 gift card. Okay, so that's awesome. And I was able to take advantage of that. I'm trying to switch things around here so I can put this in the cup holder. Um, yeah. And then I also had, there's also a thing up there for, you buy one copper tone product, you get another one. You, no, you buy two copper tone products and you get a five copper tone or banana boot or some, some, something product. Um, you got two of them, you get a $5 gift card. And then online... It had, you know, buy four, so, no, what is it, buy, sorry, I'm trying to put my phone in, buy three select um, products for Suave, you get a $5 gift card, so I was, like, I did all that, I got the two, got two copper, two sunscreen products, and three Suave products that were the select ones that I saw online, and I was expecting three $5 gift cards when I went to the cash register, but no, apparently, once again, Target is incredibly vague on their on their things. I'm going to have to flip this upside down, so my apologies, because this is the only way it's going to go in the cup holder. So, yes, I'm going to be upside down for a bit, because I'm going to need to charge my phone up. So, I'm going to vlog upside down. Right. Maybe. Um, where am I? Here we go. Cup. I'm going to get my roof or something. I don't know. I, I'm going to get my cup holder. There. That's going to get really, really crappy view, because, um, yeah. Because... My charger thingy is on the bottom of my phone, and yeah, I can't, I need to charge my phone up, so anyhow. 
So it turns out that the awesomely labeled Target $5 gift card deals was is more like you have to buy two of the exact same thing to get the discount. It does not mention that anywhere on there. So I mean, I thought you just bought two Copper Tone products or Banana Boat, whatever it was, and you got the discount. But apparently, no. Um, the guy at the when the the guy that came to the cash register was kind enough to take five dollars off for me because it, he, even he agreed it was confusing. But the swab, the hair care products, apparently, like now, I, like I don't like I'm mad at the situation, not the not at the um, workers because I know, you know, the employees they don't make this sort of policy, and I appreciate what they do, and I, so I thank them for their time and all that. Um, but if you're gonna have like he said, well the. I'm, tr I'm trying to drive and talk at the same time. I'm not as flustered as I sound, trust me. I'm, per I'm fine, but I'm just trying to focus on two things at once here. So, yeah. So, the lady was going to check me out. The so, the lady checked me out, and she had one of her coworker guys come over. So, he's the one that gave me the $5 off the sunscreen. And he mentioned that the store and the online store are considered two separate stores. Um, I thought they were both Target. I thought Target was Target, you know? I thought, it just makes sense to me that if you're going to have a deal online, that deal should apply to stores as well. Like, I, I don't get it. So, why is it that I can go to the Target website? I know you're just getting a great view of my forehead here. I'm not a light. Like, why is it that I can go to the Target website and buy three sw certain Swell products and get a $5 gift card, but I can't do the same thing in the store? Like, what is the difference? Target, seriously, anyone, want, anyone wants to send this to Target as slightly incoherent as it is, just go right on ahead, because I'd I like to know. Like, why can't y'all get your act together when it comes to the signs? Many signs are very clear that basically say, buy, th like, buy three of this very specific item and get a $5 gift card, not buy three Copper Tone products. You need to be more specific. So I know Okay, so it's 3.18 and I just picked up my dog's remains, which is just a very weird thing to say. This is what I was given. I'll cut that last piece out. Um, it's just so weird. It's a company I thought it was. And let's see what we get in the thing. We get certificate. I'm trying to make sure it doesn't have our names on it. I'm going to cover up the, um, yeah. Got the certificate of cremation. Um, when she was cremated. Uh, it has a card with my grand's name on it that I'm going to go ahead and open here. Okay. I had a letter opener, but I don't. Use my finger. Yeah. Um, so what does this have? I'm assuming it doesn't, yeah. It has this, the company's name and, and my grand's name. It's hard to, it has this note, yeah. It's hard to say goodbye to such a special companion. I'm so sorry for the loss of your beloved pet ranger. May you find peace in the happy memory shared together. That's it's handwritten. It's sweet. Yeah. That means it's a very nice note. I mean, I've never done this whole pet cremation thing before, so I don't know what they do at all. And then the box. Please don't open. Oh, this is really pretty. And I guess technically it's an urn, but yeah. It's... Which way does this go? I don't know which way it goes, honestly. So this is the company, and which, and so it's got her name on it, and it has little flowers. This is actually a very nice box, or urn. I think of an urn as being shaped more like a vase, so this, I keep calling this a box, and it's got, yeah. I guess it goes this way? Yeah. I just wish... I'm going to have to see if I can find a plaque to put on the back of it that has her date of birth and her date of death. Or, yeah. Um, because, like, I didn't know what they would put on. But, yeah. So, it's a very nice box urn thing for... It is so weird to me that a 80-something, nearly 90-pound dog can fit into this box. Man, no, okay, I know she's cremated and this is a pile of ashes in here. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to open it because I don't... Do I want to open it? It's so weird. Um, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, there she is. 
That is so bizarre. I'm gonna show. I'm, I'm gonna show you my dog. If you if you're sensitive to this, I apologize. But I, and this is completely new to me.